That's a good delivery. Seems to be going down leg for mine. Although he's asking, how is that? How is your breakfast, umpire? And this is a good ball, but it's just been picked up by the bear. And he's hit that out into the woods. Go and fetch it, bring me back some porridge at six runs. So the first maximum for the day. And that's Fuller and veering down leg and it's been lifted up over the inner circle and it runs away to the boundary for four. So a great start to this over as well. And that's all they have to do, just keep hitting a boundary every over. That one is a bit wide, and it's been picked up, and there's a man out there, Manyan, but he's not going to get it. It goes all the way, it's a six. Harsh Manyan throwing everything at it, but it was not enough to be able to reel it in and stop that boundary. So a great over already. That's more on the money, but short, and it's been pulled over square leg. And the umpire indicates, yeah, it bounced just before the rope. It is a four. This one's wide again and too short and it's punched through point and it runs away to the boundary for four. A nice shot there from the bear. And he goes after this and goes large and this is all timing. Well, go and get it. That's a harsh blow. Now Harsh has to fetch it. Maximo! What a way to finish the fourth over. This one is cut away nicely. And once again, a bit of room outside the off stump. That was perfectly placed. Let's have a look at this one in your replays. A little bit too short. Short, and this one's timed really shot. well. That is shot of the day for me. Fantastic timing. Now the bear is out of the cage, and they're above 50 and climbing. It's a great start for the Cobras. And he knocks him over right here. Bold him. How about this from the protractor? He is a prolific wicket taker. Oh, he's bowled him. And, well, he can't believe it. Once again, it's assisted. And, well, Sagal, they'll be disappointed about this. It's been a good over from Jai Araman. Just have a look at this one. Well, this is pulled away. Hooked away, really. And that's out of here. Maximo. And Slick Razik. He's not man, a man you want to give too many chances to. And this one was short. It was on the legs. And, well, he wasn't going to miss out. Goes after it, and there's nobody back here. It's just a matter of how far it will run. It will run all the way out of here. Maximo! And well, Buckets. He's having buckets of fun out there. He gets in on the action, hitting the protractor for six. Well, gets the mat on this. It's not a good ball. He's let himself down there. Jairaman. It's a full toss on the legs. And now, Yadov getting going as well. It's uh, sort of all you should hit, but you still got to get enough bat on it. And finally, up in the circle. That was always racing to the boundary. Goes up in the air, and is this going to carry it to long off? It'll be a tough one. Oh, it's really good. Really, really good fielding. Great catching, and that's Sawant, who's down at long off. Yeah. Had to come a long way in in slippery conditions. Goes after this. Is this going to get over the fielder? Well, it does. Goes all the way. Maximo! That is a crucial point in the game. And I think he just took a step in thinking it might, might not... Uh, I mean, to get to him, but well, off the bat of Rizik, he was always going to get to him more. It's just a little fingertip up, that just carries the boundary. And Rizik, oh, he's going to absolutely nail this one, and that has gone miles. Maximo! And this is a total miss hit. This is another one that should be caught, and this time it is. So Rizik, he goes for 33, and it was a nice bit of fielding at third man. Finally, his, his luck's run out. Goes after this, and I don't think this is going to be caught by anybody. Again, they're going to come for two. He's fast, but he's not this fast. <laughs> and so, well, just, just trying for every possible run at this stage, and there's no doubt that's how, what to do at this stage because it was the last ball of the innings. So, Sanjay Kumar, he'll be run out for five, but still a very handy contribution from that player. And they're going to finish 112 for five. And that's exactly what he's done. But there's a man out there and it's Slick Rizik, the first ball. Well, what a key result. Very first ball of the innings. And it was Slick Rizik catching Zishan Khan. 
Fancy footwork, that one straight down leg though. It's been picked up and lifted away by Santa Huja. That's a six. Straight over the boundary. Oh, and that's a good shot. Straight down the ground. Pass the baller. It's coming to me. I've got it, Vinny. No. Just trickled up, but it did go over the boundary. It's four runs. Great shot by Santa Huja. Look at that. And it's the one at mid-off that's going to have a chance here. But no, it's beating him. Ravi Yadav out there. Buckets. He's a big man, but he was going to have to be about 15 feet taller. That's gone all the way for a six. Kumar in. That's been picked up. Up, up and away. Gone all the way. Almost to our commentary box there from Mark Ahuja, the skipper. It's a big six straight down the ground. Saying to his brother, I can do it too. It goes after this one, and this is going to help too. This has gone a mile. Maximo. Marco Huja, and don't we love these battles of stars on stars? You've got Rizik Bowling to the Hungarian national team captain, and he sends him out of the ground. He goes after this, and this one is into orbit. Well, that might never, never come down. That was a huge hit from Stan Huja. He's getting in on the action. Goes after it, and has he got enough? Well, it's touch and go, and he's oh, gone. What and a well, catch. he is slick. He is a match winner. And he stand, stood up tall, literally stood up tall for his team right there. Sheik Rizik he removes the dangerous Stan Ahuja. He goes for 23. Big wicket. The score is 55 for two. He's after this and he nails it. And this one is out of here. Maximo, six runs. Well, that is a really confident shot. And out of Parker. Pass ball the over and he goes again. And well, watch out. Oof. <laughs> and that one's gone all the way. <laughs> Maximo! Six runs and what a way to finish the over. And it gets too short here and he gets pounded. And watch out, that one's gone downtown. Just gets it wrong, bit of a loose nut. And this is easy pickings for a batsman of this class. He goes offside this time and he times the absolute trousers off this one. That one was absolutely smashed over point and six more consecutive sixes for Delta in the seventh. He goes again. Has he got enough on this? That's the question. Oh, Sheik. Oh, great effort from the Sheik, but he can't rein it back in. Yeah, he's and slick, well, but not that slick. It's the 666, the devil's number, to start in the seventh. Yeah. And they almost get it here, but it's fortunate. And this one is dragged back off the inside edge for a boundary. Ahuja gets lucky with the French cut. Well, we are in Europe, so I suppose it's fitting. The score's up in the 90s, 91 for two. And this one's no edge. This one is going to be four. Well, certainly not now, but has this got the distance? It probably doesn't. Ashwanth Narayan, it takes the catch. So important, important wicket. Mark Ahuja, he goes for 47, so he misses out on his half century, but he has his team in excellent position. As we see the next ball, it gets through the fielder. How far is this running? Oh, it's gonna run all the way. Well, this one hurts, and he gets a little hand from on it, and felt like this is one that might have been stopped, but just couldn't couldn't field it as Kumar. Gonna join in the Budapest blinders on the top of the table. And this one, well, Bucket's gonna go right back, and even he's not tall enough to get this one. And Delta has come out and he's changed this game and he's really turned it towards the Royal Tigers. He moves up to 31 and he scored him off only eight balls. Goes after this and this one's going to tie the game. And this one is a supersonic blast to finish the eighth over. It's Ketapal. And this one's going to finish the game and they're going to finish it with a boundary. Well, what a chase by the Tigers. And they just hung in there in that batting innings and didn't let them get away to something in the kind of 130 region. Yeah, and well, Ketapal, he uh, block, block, hit. And they win this game with nine balls remaining. 116 off 8.3.